Hey guys, today I'm adding a 15 amp circuit into this Square D breaker box. First, you'll need to find out what panel you have. It is often on this little latch to the box, and then you will wanna get the appropriate breaker to match that panel. After you have your breaker, of course, the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is switch off the main to your panel. It should be up top. Make sure that is off before you start anything else. Next, you will want to remove the four or six screws that are holding the cover of your panel on. This is the 14 gauge wire that I'm going to be running into the box. This goes over to a receptacle for a circulator pump that we're going to be putting in. So the next step is to find a spot to get into the box. In my case, I'm just gonna go into this clamp right here because it only has one wire. You can put multiple wires in one clamp, but if not, there are the knockouts and you have to get one of these clamps to put into a knockout if you choose to put it into another clamp. But for me, I'm just gonna take it right into this same clamp with this wire right here. With the wire in your box, you'll want to strip this wire completely up about as far as you can go to the clamp, strip it all the way down and leave it just like the rest of these wires in this box. You want to make sure you leave plenty of wire in here in the box and just kind of curl it down around um, and leave some play in there for whatever reason you might need that later on if you come back and you move your breaker around in the box or something like that. All right, if you have the wire strip, you'll wanna take the black and the white wire and strip those all the way down to where they're bare, like so. And then you're gonna take your ground and your white wire and they are gonna go under this bus bar on either side of the panel, but in this case on the left side, there's a ground and neutral on each side. Um, so we're gonna take this neutral right under one of these lugs and take the ground right under one of those lugs, just like you see uh, the rest of these. You want to take what's left of this loop and just kind of tuck it down in just like the rest of the wires in your box are. And you can see right there is where I tied the ground and the neutral in. Next, you're ready to take your black into your circuit breaker and you're just going to loosen this screw back here on the breaker. Take your stripped wire underneath the lug on the breaker and tighten that lug down. And you're ready to pop this in, which is very simple. Just gonna curl this down around just like we did the other wires. And then it hooks onto the back side here. 
and you just push it in right like that. To take it out, you just do the same thing. Pull out on this side of it and it pops right out. It has the little uh, lips back in there. So when you're putting it in, it's gotta go tilt it in this way. At least that's the way the square D breakers are and they all are just a little bit different. Before you put the panel back on, you're gonna need to break out a spot for that new breaker that you put in. And if you just take a vice grip on the back side, just twist it right like that until it pops off and you're all set.